Welcome so, back. welcome back. Welcome, welcome back. back. You were at Hilden. We heard you were at Hilden over there in the northeast, uh, or east of Northern Ireland, as they call it. Uh, we're still here. We're uh, now uh, fading, fading fast into the weekend uh, here in the White Hag. But we have got the beer of the weekend, nay, the beer of the year for you. <laughs> You've all been waiting on this. It's the one you've held out for. We have looked at it in the fridge and you've said, I can't, I would love to, but I can't drink that beer until I do the drink along with White Hag guys. <laughs> That's what you said. That's exactly what Mikey, they said. I hear it. can't make them wait any longer. I hear it. Let's bring them into it. All right, let's rock into it. So this is the Shamrock Shake. Uh, I'm sure that many people have heard that before from somewhere else, but this is our Shamrock Shake ice cream ale, part of our Those spree guys. series. Those guys, yeah, those guys, those guys made it before. <laughs> didn't put alcohol in it though. They definitely didn't put alcohol Egypt. in it. Uh, so the spree series is just kind of a fun series of one-off beers, whatever we feel like doing for the moment. And this one yeah. has to be the most interesting and fun. And fun. Uh, <laughs> so what we have here is a green ice cream ale. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, uh, look at that green. That is flavored with mint and vanilla, much like a shamrock shake from the big old company that we all kind of know and some of us love. You know those clowns who run that company? Yeah. You know those guys? Yeah, yeah exactly. Be, clowns will be making a lot of money. <laughs> yeah. So this is a, a beer that we've brewed with lactose, mint, and vanilla. And then we have colored it. As you see there. That's with food just, coloring. Just that's food coloring. Food that's coloring. not shamrocks. <laughs> yeah. That's not shamrocks. No matter how many shamrocks you eat or chew or mash up, you cannot make a beer that right. color off shamrocks. And it's, it's actually really interesting that that food coloring did give the head a nice, just a light yeah, green hue. 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 Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know if you'd be able to see it there, but uh, it is a nice light green head yeah. to it. Yeah. It is weird looking, maybe. Getting that light. Yeah. 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 But, uh, don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. It's absolutely delicious. It tastes like melted mint ice cream. Mint ice cream. Just think before you drink this. Mint ice cream. I'm going to drink mint ice cream. Mint vanilla ice yeah. cream. Just think that. Don't With think, alcohol. Don't, don't think beer. With alcohol. <laughs> Fun times. Yeah, this guy rings in at five and a half percent. So mm. uh, it'll get you there. But it's got a it's got a real nice like light mint aroma, mm. along with a tinge of vanilla on the aroma. But yeah. it doesn't come through as much on the flavor here. So if you're anti-mint or anything like that, it, it's really well balanced. You'll get almost the opposite. You'll get more vanilla on the flavor yeah. with a hint of mint yeah. at the end. Like. Yeah. If, if you, so if, if you think the smell is off-putting because you don't like mint as much, wait for wait for the taste and wait for the flavor in the back. Yeah. It's just, it's, I didn't, I, I didn't make the beer. Mikey made the beer, but it's, and it's got to be said, this is, as close as I've ever tasted in a milkshake beer, in a beer that's supposed to be a milkshake, that actually tastes like a milkshake. Yeah, yeah. This has done it for me. Um, and it actually is very drinkable. And yeah, it's really drinkable. It's really drinkable. Yeah. Way too drinkable. <laughs> Way too drinkable. Dangerous. Dangerous. Mm. We've got, to celebrate the fact that it's St. Patrick's weekend, we're all extremely drunk, and we've got green beer, we've got a mixed case of beer to give away to you guys who stuck it out for two nights and you're at home and you're on the last beer and you're like, I'm out of beer, I need more beer. Here's how you get the beer. You go to beer52.com, select a white hag mix case and use code white hag with a one for an I and a four for an A and check out. First person to check out, because it's a single use only, gets the code. Sorry, gets the free case yeah. using the code. That's You've all there. got the code. You've all got the code, right? You've only got one the person's going to get the case. Yeah. You, they've probably got a, a fastest stage. finger yeah. challenge. Fastest yeah. finger thing. Yeah. White Hag mixed case on Beer 52, then code White Hag with a one and a four instead of an I and an A. That's right. how it works. We want you to have our mixed cases. They're up there. And there's, there's Shamrock Shake up there. I think they've got some left. They are just mixed stuff. Hopefully. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's. Is, if that's not the best beer to finish off your Paddy's weekend drinking session with, I don't know, you've stumped us. Ideas, yeah. please. If you've got ideas for other beers we should make over here in the comments, yeah. over, smash the comments, love the like, hit the unsubscribe as soon as we're finished. <laughs> make, make Doug and Rich earn their cash by trying to get you to resubscribe or something. Everyone unmass unsubscribe. I'm, I, I'm, this is going to be cut out. 
there's no way they're leaving this in. And, uh, and enjoy yourselves. Thanks for coming around Ireland with us um, and Beer 52 and all the rest of the breweries. Right. Yeah. Yeah, I really appreciate it. Until next year or until next time. Oh, yeah. if you want more, to hear more about this, at The White Hag on all the social channels. That's what we should say. At the White Hag. We'll be over in the chat telling you that as well. Yeah. Slaunch it. Slaunch it. Slaunch it.